Hey everyone, this is Jake with my bring back, continuing some of the basic WordPress functionality, and uh, today we're actually going to be going over the categories. Because after you got some of your posts generated, and you have an idea of what you're going to be blogging about or what you're going to be writing about, you want to categorize those so people can find them. So we're going to be going over how to add categories and uh, how to actually categorize your post within that in the next series. But as far as how to add categories, you can do it one of two ways. As you're writing your blog post and you're like, I need to add a new category, I need to keep this one separate from the rest of them, you can actually do it on the spot by clicking on the right hand side over here within the category section, you can actually click add new category. So then we, we've got a field that we can actually fill in. So we're going to go, uh, within here we're going to go greetings. And uh, we can make this a subcategory within the uncategorized or we can make this a new parent category. We're going to go ahead and choose a new parent category and click o add the category that's out there. So you can see now we have two categories. We've got greetings and we've got uncategorized. Right here we're actually going to, let's go ahead and input one more. And I'm going to show you how to actually do that within the other menu. So we're going to click update on this and we're going to go into the category section which if you go back up to your post you can see the third one down is categories and this is where we can actually go in here and manage our categories if we need to quick edit change the slugs etc this will also show how many posts um, are within the categories etc and what we're gonna do here is we're actually gonna uh, create a subcategory of greetings we're gonna call it top lists slug this will actually generate itself based on your name so you don't have to worry about that unless you want a special slug for uh, a URL friendly version and then right here we're gonna make the the parent category greetings we could add a description if you would like and uh, the description basically will show up in certain ways if you if you tell your category section to say display description it'll do that so in our case we're just gonna leave it blank because we're uh, showing kind of the basics here add the new category and as you can see it's now a subcategory within greetings so that, those are the two ways you can actually add categories and uh, create the create the organized structure of your blog keeping things separate so then people can also find them on your website so stay tuned we're gonna be going over how to actually categorize some of the the blog post and some some user functions for those as well so so if you haven't already subscribe to our channel so you can you can give us some input and some feedback on what you'd like to see out there and what you'd like help with so